my second mod tutorial. Now, in this video, I'm probably just gonna get some re more resources and get more equipped here for things. So, I've just found this place, and there used to be some, like, mosquito-like spawners, and I destroyed them with a the diamond pickaxe, which I got diamonds from a chest in a tree. And I got some of this very cool armor. And then one of these mantis claws for some diamond. What's that? Spawn mantis. That must have been the last thing I got was. Anyway, I think in this video I'm gonna do some exploration and get some more pets and chests. Or maybe no, maybe I'll just find some minerals and see what I can find in this chasm. Ooh. Some searches cores, I believe this is. I'm gonna find some of this, and I think what I'll do this video is do some mining about, and get some of this service course, which I'll need this to build an Emmy system now, what's this? No, I think I've got a better idea, I'll go into the not enough items options, which I think is here, go to where was it? Find some resources and then I'll come back. Look at this. I found something weird. It's black and dark. Hmm, I think I know what this is. It's. I think it might be one of those crayons from Applied and Genetics. I'll just kill this creeper off. Oh, if I, I had something well to kill it. Well, I'll just use this pickaxe for the moment. There we go. And they say if you go into the middle of one of these, you find a type of chest. And let's see if I can find it. Let's go down here. Skystone. Ah, this must be it. Well, these, these are some things I'm going to need later on when I can inscribe a press out. I'll just replace these here. No, I don't need that. I'll keep that. But I think I'll head back home now. I'm back home again. This is when I've started building my house. And I have just about the amount of materials I'm going to need to build this. It's a... Where is it? Here. A, a quartz grindstone. What that does is it pulverizes your ore. So then you can get more ingots from it. So I'm gonna need to get some some stone for this. And while that's smelting, I'll make the rod. And how you make the rod, it's... That's quite a lot of sticks anyway. I'll have to make them. And craft them here. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven. Okay, there's the rod. Now I'll just wait for this stuff to smelt and then craft the block. Okay, now to find out how to craft anything you want to know, you use the quartz grindstone, you can click it, and then maybe I'll just click this, and then click it. If I press that, you can see the crafting recipe you're going to need for it. But t to do that, I'm going to need some wooden gears. Wooden gears for sticks like this. I'll put this here. Put the quartz here, the stone... No, oh, wait. Cobble goes there, stone goes here, and then I've got a quartz grindstone. Now that I've got that down, I can put it here, and with the lever, I can right click here. No, there we go. And then I can grind anything I want by right clicking it. Now I'll just grind all this stuff down. You can see it right here, I'm grinding down my copper, and you will notice that once it's finished, it's stopped. You can't turn it anymore. However, if you keep clicking it, the lever will break. So you can't click it once you've ground everything down. Okay, I've ground everything down now. So, what should I do? I think, well, now I'll just go through some of the mods that I have. I've got the Applied in Genetics mod, which is for, like, building, like, a huge computer to store all your items in. And you're going to need these three presses, which I found in that crater. But... Um, 
something else. Well, some of like the mods I like is build craft, cause that has like some that has pipes which you can use to transport your items like these and sort them out. But I'll. But this is good when you're getting to further into automation, which I'll show you a lot more about when you get lots more things. So now I'm going to start a little mine and mine some things, and I'll be back. Now one thing when you're mining in mods, just like in normal Minecraft, all the best minerals can be found at layer 11. So I'll dig until I find layer 11, so that will be my best bet of finding all the minerals. I'm at layer 11, and I found diamond. But I can't be suspicious, because sometimes you can find troll blocks. Oh, this is a real diamond. Hmm. <laughs> That's unexpected. Oh well. Well, I'll just continue this lay 11 mine, because I'm going to save up to get some stuff to build a, pow a, a redstone flux power source. Now, the things I need are steam dynamo and some redstone so I can build a redneck energy table cable and then I can power all sorts of things. Anyway, I'll come back when I've got some stuff. I found another one of these and I'm gonna see if I can just have tried to do what I did last time. Hurry. Come on. No! No, too late, too late, too late. I didn't do it right. They're after me, they're after me. No! No, run away! Run away, run away! Well, at least I've got away from the mine. I think. But what do I do? I was collecting wood for my house, which is almost finished. But I've got some materials to build some of the things I need. The just mm. last thing I need is sand. So I'll just collect some of that. And I'll probably be able to build what I need. Mm. Okay, that's the sand I need. I can go back. Now, this is, I think I'll just wait to get enough glass. Okay, let's see. What I'm trying to craft is a machine frame. Machine. There it is. Machine frame, and I'll need tin gear. Which I should be able to make with that tin I smelted and my iron. Let's see. Let's see, I need my tin iron. Okay, here we are. No, wrong one. Iron in the middle, tin around it. That's what I need, and that there, and I think it was like this for the machine frame. There we go. Okay, now I'll just craft the rest. Okay, I think I've got everything I'm gonna need for the pulverizer and the redstone dome. Well, I need about four, I think it is. These four, four. these are four copper gears I'm gonna make, and then I'm gonna need two coils, one of them has to be made out of silver redstone transmission and this one is redstone reception. Then I'm gonna need a piston which will be this, this, this and this. And then I think I'll craft the 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 what is it? The dark the pulverizer, that's what I should I say first. Oh, it's done. Oops, there we go. There's the pulverizer. And now for the redstone dynamo. Here, here, redstone here, and copper here. There we go. Now that I've got this up, the d what the dynamo does is it's very similar to what, I mean, the pulverizer does the same thing as this, only it's automatic. And to power it, you need to put wa water in the dynamo and coal so that will be enough coal I to operate this pulverize for now and I'll be able to pulverize all this anyway this will be the end of this tutorial I hope you enjoyed it as much as I enjoyed recording it if you'd like to see some more from me maybe you could subscribe and if you enjoyed this mod at Minecraft please leave a like and please leave any comments down below and this is Eddie6716 out.